on the opposite side. So if we started off with right, we're going left. If we started off with left, we're going right. All right, here we go. In 10 seconds. But remember, chest up, shoulders roll back. Here we go. In three, two, one. Let's go. Good. A little key trick to get a little bit more balance, clamp that big toe down. You're going to find out that your balance gets a little bit better with that. There you go. Think of like your toes are the roots of a tree and we're digging them right into the ground. Pivoting at the waist, slight bend in the knee. So we're not coming down, it's not a one-legged squat. We're right here, leaning forward, driving back with our shoulders. Leaning forward, tighten your core. This is where it's gonna be most vulnerable, your lower back is. Good. Drive those shoulders back. 20 seconds, here we go. Almost there. Good. Keep breathing. Almost there. Five, four, three, two, one, and relax. All right, good job. That was strength. All right, your last one. Four. You can do this. Only three rounds, three minutes of exercise, all right? This is our last little bit. We're going to start off with plank. Level one, you're going to watch Joy, or sorry, today. We're going to have our hands on the seat. You're going to stay in this position. Level two, over here with Matt. Making sure that we're tightening our hips and our core. You want to almost feel like you're driving that course, that pelvis kind of crooked up a little bit. Tighten that stomach. And we're going to keep that straight line. And with me, we're going to be up and nice and tall. Hands are going to be right underneath the shoulders. And if you're going to be over here with Matt, elbows are going to be right underneath your shoulders. Okay? Almost there. We've got 10 seconds left of this rest, and then we're going on. Here we go. So let's go ahead and get down on our sections. Three, two, one. Let's go. Here we go. Making sure that if you want it a little bit easier, your hips are starting to swag a little bit. You want to spread your feet out a little bit. That takes a little bit of the stability out of this. If you want to get a little bit harder, bring those feet right next to each other. And now you have to tighten your core even more to stay upright. Woo! Here we go. Remember, hands are going to be right underneath the shoulders. Right here. We're not up here. This is not the plank that I want. This is the plank I want right here. Keep it going. You're already 30 seconds in. Keep breathing. If you feel like you're going to fall, that's okay. Remember, drop to those knees. Count to five. One, two, three, four, five. Then pop right back up. This is where you're going to test yourself. This is where you can see how long you can go. If you have to drop down this time, maybe next time you don't have to. It's okay. Just keep moving. And relax. 30 second break. Next one is going to be our atomic sit-ups. Remember, you're going to be, you're going to be uh, safe, sitting down right here. What we're going to do is we're going to bring one knee up, curl forward, tighten your stomach, and then crunch those abs forward. And then we're going to lean back as those legs go down. Over here, we're going to do the C crunch. Remember, right here, 90 degrees at the knees. We're going to bring it up and back. Level three, you're going to be with me. Here we go. Bring it out. Tighten your core. If you're going to be doing what I'm doing, you want to make sure that your lower back is completely flat against the ground right now, and then come up. If at all times, at any time your back come, comes up, I want you to move down to level two. It's okay. You're still going to get a great workout, trust me. But we want to make sure our back is flat if you're going to do level three. Okay? And we're not pulling on to the chest or the neck right here. We're not pulling there. We want the abs to bring you up, not your shoulders, all right? So right here, if you want to, stick those hands out there. And then make sure you don't pull on anything. 15 left, here we go. Breathe through it, tighten that core as you extend those legs out. Good. Five seconds, come on. Two, one, relax, woo! All right, guys, this is your last exercise. I want you to give me 110% on this one. We're going to do the cross climbers. Over here, we're going to be on the wall. 
Remember, knee is going to come up just to the waist. We're going to bring it over a little bit and then back down. Level two, you're going to be on the floor. Same thing. Knees coming up to the waist. Bring it over a little bit and back down. We're alternating sides. Level three, you're with me. Here we go. So, same thing as the plank. You want to keep your hands right underneath your shoulders. Bring that knee up for level three. Rotate over and back down. Now tighten that core. Make sure you're not pushing too much stress on your shoulders. So bring up, rotate, back down, forward, good. Tighten your core. I don't want sagging hips, no. And I don't want TPs either. So we're right here. Bring it in, over, back down, good. 30 seconds, come on. This is your last one and then we're done. Breathe through it. Good, tighten that core. You should start, you guys should be screaming right now. Good. 15 seconds. Breathe through it. Almost there. Five, four, three, two, and one. Great job, everybody. Way to go, way to go, way to go. So, Thank you so much for joining us virtually today. Thank you for continuing to support the mission. Tune in tomorrow for another new workout. Thanks, guys.